everyone, it is me, TNTN, and I am back with another episode on the Rosecraft server. Uh, you guys probably saw the Tazcraft server uh, tour. Yeah, we're not going to play on that until the reset, actually. Sorry about that. Uh, but anyway, we're going to get right into this. You'll see we have a skeleton spawner right here, which is... Oh, hi, Dead Kick. Okay, he's now in spectator. Long story. Uh, anyway, uh, he basically found this for me, which is amazing because he's amazing, like usual. And no, he did not use spectator, so no one said that he cheated, okay? I saw him do it with my bare hands, okay? Just saying, just saying, okay? Uh, but anyway, uh, I'm really excited to get working on the skeleton farm, and we're gonna do it right now. We noticed that I have a nice uh, diamond helmet and also a diamond pickaxe. Yeah, I went mining. I found a, some pretty good uh, stuff, which is awesome. We're not really gonna go into depth with that right now, but just, know that I have a diamond stuff now. Well, some at least. <laughs> now this is the design we're going off of, so the skeletons spawn here. I made this by the way, I'm pretty sure there's like a hundred thousand designs that are the same. But then they go into here, and then they're all on top of hoppers. Basically we just grab a sword, like a really powerful sword for skeletons specifically, cause you know, smite and whatnot. And then we just kill them all. And I'm gonna be just go like overnight. And um, I'm just gonna kill them in the morning, and I'm just gonna have a ton. Uh, but if we head up here, just a few things, a few like notes. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven um, blocks down. Uh, it doesn't really matter, but I just thought that I should point that out for anyone who wants to do this. And then down here, you need a really like a lot and a lot because a lot spawn. I don't really know the exact calculation. Let me see. Let me count. So it takes 41 toppers in total to just get here. Uh, so just like all of this, that's how that's the length. And then just a few extra to go into a chest. So if we just kill one right now, just kill one. Just, just there we go. It'll get picked up by the hoppers and go right into here, which is awesome. Uh, so this is what we're going to go off of. Now, something that I really should mention is that me and Die Kick are actually working together. We're going to have, like, shops and whatnot. We're going to get, like, half the cut because we both really like uh, working together. And also, Die Kick's, like, amazing at this game, so <clears throat> just saying. Uh, anyway, uh, so I'm really excited for that. And I'm going to basically just make a store from the Skeleton Spawner. Uh, so the eye kick's gonna get like half the cut, but he also has like a mending shop or something and he's gonna make other ones and I'm gonna get half the cut from that and of course it's not gonna be our only shop, so yeah, it should be awesome. So this is what we have right now and this is just a four by, well actually it's a four from here to the spawner, but in real life it's nine uh, by nine area because from here to there it's nine. Uh, and that's just because if you place water here, water here, water here, and water here, just in four of the corners, then all the water is going to drain and go right into here, but the, it will not actually, like, and go into this hole. It'll just, like, go right up to this hole, which will be awesome. So now we just have to dig down, I think I said seven blocks or something like that. No, times like these, I just really, really wish you had efficiency, efficiency five. I'm over here just struggling. <laughs> I really miss it. I really miss my old tools, my old armor. Uh, I hate starting from scratch. Alright, we got down to the correct level, so now we just have to place a water bucket there. Let's just, I know this is kind of cheating just a little bit, but we're just going to go slash home and go over in here and just take water from our well. And then slash home spawner. And I'm going to just place a bucket over here. I know it's a little bit cheaty. But I don't feel like making an infinite source and whatnot, so I'm just gonna do this for right now. <laughs> and there we go, we have a drop down chamber. So I'm just gonna dig down a little bit and let's go off to the side so that I don't just dig straight down, because that's like the number one rule of Minecraft is to not dig straight down. Uh, so that's much, much safer way. I just did, just saying. <laughs> So this is what we have right now. This is like where they drop down and then you just spread out apart here. We'll replace it with hoppers and everything. But as of right now, I just want to go and have them start spawning. So I'm just going to go home spawner. And then I'm just going to take away all these torches and hope that they'll spawn. And we can just get stuff without having to pick it up with hoppers and everything. Well, uh, it cost me a stack of iron and now we only have like three plus so a few more. Uh, but I got efficiency five book. So, oh, whoa, there's smite. Oh, oh, sweeping edge too. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
we need both of those things for making our skeleton farm. Should I use our proficiency five or for both of those? Ugh, dang, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. You know what, let's just use it as proficiency five. Uh, so let's go back to skeleton, oh wait, spa spawner, that's what it's called. Ah, there we go, yeah. And, oh, I didn't finish lighting that up, but it's okay. Let's just put this on my, p oh, I don't have an anvil. Well, I found an anvil. I do not want to say where I found it, but I used it. It was someone's base. I'm going to say that. And I'm also going to say that they're online, and, and I'm also going to say that I wasn't die kick. Ah! And now it's 100% dark in here, which is fun-ish. Yeah, I'm gonna get down before a loss start to spawn. And we're safe. Okay, great. And they don't seem to, oh, nope, they do notice us, okay. Well, it's working, we're getting spawns, so that's good. I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm happy so far. Once we have hoppers and like a good sword, it will be amazing. But until de then, this, this will definitely do. So right now, I wanna actually go AFK, but before I do so, I wanna make um, a, 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 a farm, a, 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 a AFK fish farm, that's what it's called, and I know that uh, a, a Desert Rose has one, which is this one right here, and I want to make it like this one, uh, so how does this work, that's the question, oh wait, I think, I think you hold, do that, no, maybe here, no, maybe, I, I have no idea. Ah! So this is how it works. You look at the sign, and then once you catch something, you'll see that the bobber, um, the, the little pressure plate lifts up, so then you're not looking at the water. And I don't know how to explain life. <laughs> you have to get right in the right place, though, so yeah. I mean, seriously, though, look at how simple this is. We can make this in, like, two seconds. It's awesome. I love it. Okay, well, after going for like two hours or three hours or something uh, out at uh, Desert Rose's AFK fish farm, yes, I did use hers because I wanted like rods and whatnot, which I did get. Uh, these two, uh, I just have to combine them, but I do not have enough levels yet, sadly. And wow, these are really deteriorating. Anyway, uh, but that's awesome, so we'll be making one really, really shortly. And then I also got a lot of nice um, different enchanting books. Why, why do I have this? I don't want that. I don't even know what that is. And then I also have these efficiencies that I'm going to put together later so that um, they're efficiency five in the end. So that's awesome. I'm really, really happy. But I have to go get some levels now. But first I had a saddle left over just when I was going AFK fishing and I also just had an extra, an extra, uh, fish, a, a, a fish, fish, fishing line, uh, and a stick, so, I have carrot, so just like, why not? I'm sorry, I cut early, I meant to say PHANTOMS! But man, this, this is absolutely adorable. I love this so much. I'm just gonna put him right there. I know, I know it's horse parking, but you know what? Pigs should be included because pigs are awesome. Okay, just saying. Now, as I'm waiting for skeletons to just fill in, and I have been killing them. That's why there's none right now. Um, I have been clearing out uh, this nice little part right here, and we're gonna be adding um, like probably a melon farm and like a fishing AFK fishing farm and a pumpkin farm and a wheat farm maybe if i feel like getting villagers we'll, we'll do like a lot of stuff here this is gonna be our main afk spot all right so i also finished my afk fish spot which is awesome so i'm going to go afk for a while well actually i'm gonna get a few more levels then i'm gonna go afk and yes i do know that there's a much better way to do this instead of putting a hopper right down there but i'm kind of in a rush so i'm gonna have to leave it at that <laughs> Also, I moved it because you actually have to be pretty close to the skeleton farm for it to work, and also, um, why not? And also, I added this right here. Just, just a quick little reminder to, like, uh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> nope. No. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this. There are so many skeletons in here. I don't know how long I've been AFK for, but I am so happy right now. I'm gonna go down the line and just kill them all. Oh, this is so awesome. This is amazing. I'm just going down the line and they like see me and then they try to shoot me but they end up shooting themselves and then the guy next to them gets enraged and then starts shooting them and then they start shooting him. 
Oh man, this is great. This is just too great, guys. <laughs> so keep in mind, this is without looting three, but we have two stacks, almost three stacks, and then almost three stacks of arrows too. I also have this, but that was from um, a while ago. This was not like this first AFK one that we just did. So I am very, very, very happy with how this has turned out. So I'm gonna go AFK overnight probably, and I will catch you guys later. All right, so it went really, really well. This is like three or four days later because I got sick again. Um, so, cool. Oh, where do I even start? So much has changed. Uh, but the biggest thing, the biggest change is uh, this on Elytra. Yeah, uh, you guys probably saw it like at the very beginning. You can probably see a little bit. Ugh, long, long story. We'll get to all that right after this. Um, so you'll see that all the hoppers are in, and you'll also see these chests and whatnot over here. And you'll see these chests and blah, blah, so much, so much. Okay, uh, so start off. I got all this done because Die Kick came while I was AFK and put in all these hoppers and these chests and whatnot. I didn't like it though, so I took away the... Um, the hoppers and I used them in here instead and I s just kept a few because like here because I didn't want to take all of them because I was lazy uh, and then these are being used as storage I'll get to that in just a second uh, so basically I sat for like 15 minutes or something and all this was filled and I killed them all and I did this multiple 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 times and this is what we have so all this that's from AFK fishing we'll get to that in a second uh, this amount of bones plus uh, this amount of bones yeah I know right <laughs> um, we have this many arrows plus some more we'll get to that a lot of bows uh, a lot of armor uh, enchanted book that's from AFK fishing we'll get to that uh, more bows and more arrows and I think more bows and yeah I think that's it <laughs> so a lot over here we have diamonds um, actually let's do this a little bit later let's go to AFK fishing yes that's a lot of diamonds I understand that we'll get to that in a second um, so if we head down here, this was like a three or four nights of AFKing, like overnight. So we have a lot of this, a lot of that, a lot of this, a lot of that. Um, and I already took out all the enchanted books and I sold a lot of them. But we have a nice good pick now, a nice uh, sword. I know it has smite five instead of... Um, instead of sharpness and that's because we're dealing with a lot of skeletons here. And yes, we will get another sword later. Uh, Whew. Another thing, the diamonds and elytra and everything, let's explain that right now. So if we go to slash warp uh, the end, you'll see that the end is officially opened. And basically, the dragon fight was supposed to be taken tomorrow. We are all going to join up and do that. Uh, however, we were allowed to go and... Um, basically bridge out super duper duper far to where the end cities would appear because if you guys do not know that portal just takes you somewhere in the end world we're already there if we just branch out enough we will get to like the end cities and everything and we can always get back so we can do slash home or whatever thing is someone accidentally didn't know that we were going to be doing the dragon fight all together tomorrow and kill the dragon today on their own uh so that was great <laughs> Uh, but I did get a lot of elytras and everything, and shulker boxes, and I ended up actually, wow, it's lagging, insane. Um, but basically, I lost my train of thought, I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, yep, so we're gonna basically bring, uh, bring the dragon back to life, so don't worry, that will still happen, and it'll be fun, it'll be posted in the next video, uh, probably, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, but now we are doing, uh, so I basically, bleep, I'm sorry, I cannot talk guys. So I sold a lot of elytras, I sold a lot of shulker boxes because everyone wanted them. Uh, so if we go back to our, uh, our, our, uh, spawner, that's what it is. You'll see that we have so many diamonds now. I made this all in one day. Only problem is we have to split it with die kick because we are a team and we are going to be splitting all diamonds from sales half and half. So I'm okay with it because I'm going to be getting a lot of diamonds in return, let me tell you. But he's going to be so excited when he comes on. So yeah, that basically catches everyone up on everything. <laughs> 
Whew. Now, because I actually found quite a few diamonds while end busting, like in the boxes, and I don't have to give that to Die Kick, uh, he ends up with 46 diamonds, I believe. So, lucky Die Kick, that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> So, it's actually on Peaceful right now. This server is, like, super chill. It's not, like, about, um, uh, like, doing hard work or anything. It's all about just, like, having fun. So, basically, it's on Peaceful right now. And that is just to get, um, these guys helping on their guardian farm. Because apparently tons and tons of guardians are just spawning constantly right now. Uh, and I'm just gonna help them down because I help them out because I really need, um, like, stuff <laughs> uh, I really need skeleton spawners that's what it is uh, so I'm just gonna try to make things go faster all right it is done so if we wait a second guardians should be piling in and I get two free passes which is awesome because I need XP right now so yay yeah, so never mind. We actually have to take out all this, put, replace it with soul sand, make sure that this block above it is a full water block, not like a non-water block. Yeah, we still have a lot to go, but luckily I'm getting free like uses while working on this, so that's fun. Well, that was painful, but we got it all done. Look at it. Awesome. So I'm super duper happy. Yay did it i'm so happy okay great 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 <laughs> but sadly that's all i have time for today guys thank you so much for joining me on this another uh, episode if you guys enjoyed this episode then please hit that like uh, like button and that subscribe button if you want to see more videos done by me also hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified every single time i post a new video uh but that's it for today guys thank you bye